Welcome back, Patriots, to another school year and another season of Mason Cable News. I'm Olivia Whitehouse. And I'm Kayla Cade. Join MEJA as they join other local youth organizations as they, strike to, as they strike to demand a safe and survivable future on September 20th, starting at 11 a.m. at Lafayette Square. They will also be holding a special poster making session later today, starting at 7.30 p.m. in Sub 1, Room 3A. Make sure to head on over to Mason 360 to register. Pack is taking over the museum once again, this Sunday, September 22nd at 9 a.m. Don't lose out on a chance to pick up your free tickets. Make sure you stop by the Office of Student Involvement while tickets still last. Mason students, faculty, staff, and alumni are invited one night only to shop mega discounts on professional wear. One of Mason's most highly anticipated nights, Suit Up Mason, is happening Sunday, September 22nd, starting at 7 p.m. Make sure to bring your Mason ID to receive a coupon for 30% off your entire purchase of professional wear, including shoes and accessories. You can combine this coupon with other in-store offers for up to 60% off most items. You do not want to miss this. We'll be back after this commercial break. You're watching Mason Cable News. Calling all models. PAC is seeking models for the HIV and AIDS Awareness Fashion Show. If you have a passion for walking the runway, join PAC for their model call. Both males and females are welcome. Please bring heels for the audition. Auditions are being held in the JC Bistro, Sunday, September 22nd at 7 p.m. Did you know that the month of September is Hispanic Heritage Month? Throughout the month, there will be various events to highlight not only the organizations on campus, but the rich diversity of the Hispanic culture. Join HSA as they host Minute to Win It in the Patriot Lounge, Room 3A, starting at 7 p.m. The winning team gets a free HSA t-shirt. Be sure to bring your A-game. Next Thursday, September 26, come out and celebrate the German culture by joining PAC and enjoy free authentic German food non-alcoholic beer beverages, and fun games. This all will be taking place at Sub One Lawn starting at 5 p.m. After this commercial break, Vince will be giving us the rundown on what our Mason athletics have been up to. You are watching Mason Cable News. What's going on Mason Nation? It's Vince Garbett coming at you guys with some more weekly sports updates. This week, women's volleyball defeated the University of Maryland for the first time since 2002 on Saturday afternoon at the Xfinity Center Pavilion in College Park, Maryland. The Patriots were able to defeat the Terps in a five-set showdown with scores of 28 to 26, 15 to 25, 25 to 23, 9 to 25, and 16 to 14. Mason, who is currently three and six, split this the final day of Maryland, the Maryland Invitational later falling to the University of Arkansas in four sets. Sophomore opposite Sally New posted 23 total kills, five aces, and nine blocks over the two matches. She registered a team high in kills with 17 and a career high four service aces against Maryland. Fellow sophomore Cerrone Hardy recorded 28 total kills, 13 digs, in five blocks. Hardy also put down a career high at 16 kills in Mason's four set loss to the University of Arkansas. Now let's get into our game of the week. Next week's game is more women's volleyball action, but this time they're taking on Wake Forest on Saturday, September 20th at 7 p.m. located in the Fairfax Recreational Athletic Complex. At this game, they'll be handing out Mason license plate. And remember, entry is free for all students who come with their Mason ID. So there's no reason for you guys not to come out and show your Mason school spirit and be a part of Mason Nation. Finally, I want to give a huge shout out to our Mason Athletes of the Week. This week for men's cross country, we have Jake Lonsdale. And from women's volleyball, again, we have Shelly New. Congratulations to you guys and keep up the hard work. Unfortunately, that is all the time for me. Come back next week and catch more sports weekly updates. We'll be back with our roundtable discussion on the first few weeks of school. You're worth watching Mason Cable Network. With the first few weeks of class already started, students are starting to get into a flow with their classes and balancing new schedules. 
Kayla, what are some tips that you have that will help people adjust to the new schedule and well, get through the semester? Well, I've learned to not procrastinate and always manage your time wisely. Absolutely. One tip that I have for everyone is to always make sure to write everything down and to make sure to always stay on top of your due dates because once you fall behind, it can be kind of difficult to get caught up. But you always can if you always make sure you have everything written down. Mm -hmm. Well, Patriots, thank you for tuning in this evening. You can keep up to date with news on and off campus if you follow us on Instagram at MCN on TV, on Twitter, and Facebook at Mason Cable News, and subscribe to our YouTube channel at Mason Cable Network. My name is Kayla Cade. And I'm Olivia Whitehouse. Thank you for tuning in, Patriots. We'll see you back here next week on Mason Cable News.